Yum, yum! William Vaughn here with a quick look at the Explode Mesh tools in the Hatchet Collection for Moto. The Explode tools were originally created to aid in baking high-res mesh detail to low-poly meshes for use in games, but I have found them to be useful for other things as well. When working on complex meshes made up of multiple parts, it can become challenging to find specific pieces or to quickly select geometry that may be occluded. Explode will create a morph target that moves all the parts in 3D space, making it easier to isolate specific parts. Exploded views can also be useful when presenting a product or creating technical drawings and animations. To explode a mesh, simply select the mesh item and choose which explode option you'd like to use. You can explode your mesh based on contiguous meshes, parts, polygon selection sets, vertex selection sets, or edge selection sets. In this example, I'll use explode connected. Choose the distance you'd like to have your parts exploded using the explode range. A morph will be created so that your base mesh is left unedited. A morph deformer is also created, freeing the need of setting up the morph manually for rendering or baking. Use the morph influence to adjust the spacing of the parts to your liking or to animate the parts moving over time. Oh, look at the time.